So it's gyrocopter time. Arranged carry, nuker, disabler. It's very funny to me that he's an agility hero. Okay, this is giving me some serious uh, Farnham. Does anyone remember Drunk Farnham from Diablo 1? So, let's check it out. All systems nominal. It's kind of like a drunk Sean, Sean Connery. All systems nominal. So, what you got for us, boy? Launches a salvo of rockets at nearby enemy units. Bingo! Rocket barrage! <laughs> What's that? What's that? It's just damage. Rockets per second, rocket damage. So how much are we doing? 240? Oh, you do more against single target? Ah. You don't want to have max targets. It doesn't have rockets to spare. Oh yeah, I see that now. Better against single target, okay? Homing missile. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Fires a homing missile to seek the targeted enemy. Strong dispels only. Like BKB, yeah? Fires a homing missile. It gains speed over time, dealing damage and stunning when it impacts. Enemy units... Um, enemy units can destroy the missile before it reaches its target. Three hits to destroy. Towers do half damage to the missile. Uh, flat cannon. Gyrocopters attacks hit all enemy units in an area around it. Oh, I, I think I've seen that. Pew pew. Uh, duration three, four, five, six. Only the main target of attacks will receive attack bonuses such as critical strike. Last 10 seconds or until all attacks are used. Oh, I see, I see. Physical damage, magical damage, homing missile. And we are uh, agility hero, so we're gonna get high armor class. So for gyrocopter, it seems really important to have BKB so that you can safely do that. And maybe even things like Yules or Force Staff, I don't know. Let's see. Well, we'll see about that later. But first, let's look at the eggs. Flak Cannon adds a sight gunner that at random attacks additional enemy units near gyrocopter. Like, just straight up. Prioritizes furthest units away within its range. Yes, sir! <laughs> Wait, it's the same DPS? Sight gunner fire rate, 1.2. Wow. 1.2. What does that mean? It, that it attacks faster than myself. No, it has a fixed fire rate. Ah. Okay, okay. What's up with the range, by the way? It seems quite big, the range. It has more range than my auto attack. Side gunner attack rate is 700. Check ult, call down, call down an aerial missile strike. Wow. There we go. On an enemy unit in a target area, after two seconds, two missiles arrive in succession within two with two seconds between them. Missile one damage, missile two damage. Interesting scaling. They both have the same final damage, but missile two damage does more at uh, level 10, uh, level six. Missile 1 slow 30. Missile 1 slow 60. Missile 2. Got my bearings. Okay. Um, pretty good damage and some slow. Uh, cooldown decent. Pretty reasonable. 90 seconds. Now let's look at this uh, shard. Homing missile now constantly fires the current level of rocket barrage. In a 725 AoE, after one second of being cast, the rocket barrage prioritizes the homing missile target. Wow, quite nice. He's a fun hero. So both of these are just straight up extra damage. Shard is very OP, yeah, it's very strong. 
You should pull creeps only when the laners push near their tower. Okay, not when the laners are uh, meeting literally right there, right? say that I've discovered another feature of Dota that I love when someone leaves the rest is allowed to leave without punishment do you know how much we lobbied for that in Heroes of the Storm and it never happened I am against forfeiting early as a team but if someone leaves the rest shouldn't be punished with a forced 20 minute game with a bot I love it Just for unranked? Really? Yes, sir. You still lose MMR in ranked. Mm. Do you lose less? But you don't get behavioral score or penalty. Okay, that, that's the that's the point for me. Not losing behavior score or penalty. Did someone just use the die? Bang, bang, bang. So much for my retirement. What's that? Got my bearings. Our gyro that? position four, you need to get the shard as fast as possible, trust me. Yep, it's on top of the build. Trajectory confirmed. Roger. Rotating. Fox two. Yes, sir. I'm under attack. Deploying. Hmm, they're somehow not in the lane. Oh my god, two shots from a tower, that's too much. It's tight, Hunter. Do they have a lot of um, spells? Let's see. Does Tight Hunter cast a lot of spells? Yeah, so wand is kind of worth it. Oh god. Wait, where's the camp? They killed it already? I blocked it. Oh, before. Oh, you mean previously I accidentally flew over it? Come on. Oh, you're All right. Systems nominal. Bingo. Come here, you. Large <laughs> maneuver. Mumbling. Centaur seems fine. Yeah, I'm level one. <laughs> Trajectory confirmed. Not yet. Got my second. Uh oh, I'm pulling the archer creeps. All systems nominal. Does he have a bottle? He does not have a bottle. What's 
Do I just take this? He's not taking it. He has no items. Ka-ching. That means he has a sentry ward here. Damn it, I cast Q and there was no enemies. They have work or we don't stack. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Phantom Lancer, no items. Why? You think he's rushing like a... Oh, he, he rushed Bl Blade of Alacrity. He rushed Blade of Alacrity. I didn't know you could see your allies' stacks, by the way. Like uh, their stash. That's funny. I should have let him last hit it. Sorry. Very little mana. Very tame lane. Is it because we because we suck or because I, I suck? Yes, sir. Roger. Bangs out. No. Jara, answer your question. What did he say? <laughs> hey, how come they put a sentry there and then didn't act on it? So, bl Blade of Alacrity Rush, interesting. You need to pull the cap at X16, X46. Okay, cool. Hey, Kirby, when are you playing Warcraft 3? Friday. I keep farming their bounty. Yes, sir. Your middle tower is under attack. Wait, how did a catapult just teleport in? All systems nominal. Oh wait, he must have uh, banished it, right? Did we win last game? Uh, the gyro capture game, we didn't actually play it. We didn't really play it. Is that just to secure the last hit? Wow. What's that? Oh my god, what was that? I feel like he just tore my face off, dude. Just tore my face. Was that his ult, really? Deploying. Minus int? What do you mean? It's a two-minute cooldown ult. Oh wow! 
So that was a nice pull. I think that was effective. Switch your mumbling. He's dead. What's that? Repositioning. Oh, run. 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 Outworld Destroyer came with a rotation. What's that? Oh, he rampaged for this, right? Bingo. Oh, that's what that sound was. Your middle tower is under attack. I should be farming mid, I guess. It says Q next. No, no, no. Where, where did he go? Phantom Lancer went for some jungling. So, Outworld Destroyer's ult is just a giant nuke. Okay. I'm under attack. What's that? Your top tower is under attack. Fox two. Get him, get him, get him. The rocket. Nice. Ah! Get him, Phantom Lancer! Yes! <laughs> you should have 14 on the gold before minute 15 so you get shard. You think shard first? I think it's worth it to kill OD. OD is uh, overdosing on... Oh, hold on. I think it's worth it to get OD because... Uh, wait, should I get Veil of Discord first? Or, or, or Shard? Oh, shit. I don't have alerts on. Sorry. Replay. Yeah, I think we're going to get an artificial hype train here because I had no alerts on. Let's go. How we do it. Thanks for the sub. Shard first? Yeah, I don't mind getting shard first. I thank you. Put a lotus on the brew and test it so you can be ready for the shenanigans. What? This will come in handy. I'm gonna get the mass first, then I'll get the shard. Your top yes. tower has fallen. I'm under attack! All systems not Quit your mumbling. Your middle tower is under attack.
He's fine, right? Like, he can't die to them, can he? I think so. Phantom Lancer is level 10. Not yes, bad. Sir. Is he the first to reach level 10? I think so. What do you guys think about Phantom Lancer's no item build? Straight. Oh, damn it. CS lol. I thank you. You need a thicker skin if you want to learn this game smile. At the moment, I am not convinced you have the mental fortitude. Yeah, yeah. Dota 2 is ruthless. What? <laughs> No command, dude. I dare you to run. Got my bearings. Thanks for the three dollars. Rocket barrage. Diverting. I thank you. Easy W. Outworld destroyer is a potato. Welcome. He's allowed to learn to. We don't need to trash talk him. Yeah. What the hell is that? Your bottom tower is under attack. Twice the harm. Watch that. Hey, hey, man. There we go. Thanks for the raid, e Eternal Envy. Oh, no. I, it, did... yes, is it sir. over? Your middle tower is under attack. Banished. I don't know if I dare to go in here. <laughs> Yoink! I saved someone? Who did I save? Neutral item, yes, thank you. Got my bearings. Oops. So we've got the mask now. Oh, I'm dead, right? I'm not dead. Yo, what the hell? He could have killed you. Who? You mean sniper? I I flew too close to the moon. So which neutral item? Attacking from behind, mana attributes, pig out. I think I'll play for mana this time. I and we'll go for shard next. Try to buy divine rapier. It's very good with her third skill. Think it will be auto then. I'm not playing core, otherwise, because this sounds like a golden advice. But if I was playing core, I would definitely uh, follow your advice. Sounds great. Thank you for the well-intentioned good tip. Odie's Banish makes him scale, debuff? What does that mean? Maneuvering! Maneuvering! What's that? What's that? What's that? Radiant he steals mana? Okay, but it doesn't mean anything to me. Odie's buff makes him scale What's mana. That? Rocket 
cool. Let's get uh, observer work. No, no, no. Odin gains damage with each orb. Yeah, I don't know what that means too. It's okay, guys. We don't need to know it to play this game. The way you're writing it is yeah, not yeah. unambiguously understandable. Get shards soonish. What's that? Fireworks! What's that? He's pretty good at jungling, actually. Not With yet. the Q. Definitely worth jungling. Magic resist spell damage. Plus six spell damage. That seems kind of legit. I'm mostly spell casting anyway. Actually, I should be like pushing out one top, but the lane is. No, I just go both. Wow, I killed it. So we all TP'd here. It's good damage, man. Jeez. Nice. Uh, nice, but not nice, actually. Our banish make you lose max mana every time. Then his ult damage and Q based on mana difference between him and target, he can one shot hero. His ult. Makes you permanently drop mana. So how can you play against him? It's just unfair. Your bottom tower has fallen. Oh temporary. Oh <laughs> I was like, I thought he just goes around to people and, and freaking clicks them. Your bottom tower is under attack. That felt unfair. Time is money. Just during a fight, yeah, okay. Oh, I forgot to use C, right? Yeah, I'll try to use C next time. I could probably use C on camps as well. Does it work on creeps? No, heroes only. If I had shard there. That went well. What's E again? I forgot what E does. Oh, yeah. Is he trying to catch me, bro? I'm gonna rampage you. 
I'm gonna break your face. He can't run from us. No, sir. <laughs> It's Stampede, not Rampage. Oh. <laughs> Shit. I should have read that before. <laughs> the the now I look like a noob. <laughs> oh, Rampage is when you kill five heroes. Oh, yeah. I let him hit. Oh. The, the dire kill tower. Ending. Oops. What's next? Mantle. Okay, sure. How much? Three fifty. Mind if I roll knee? Your middle tower is under attack. What's that? Whoa, Stampede. <laughs> this hero is nice of course it's a winning game too but it's probably winning at least 95 percent of the reason because of gyrocopter you know i think so i'm dead <laughs> oh no don't clip don't clip Okay, 15%. I got cocky and I stopped thinking. And then I hit enemy hero and the tower retargeted on me. And yeah. what's, what's more is probably because, yeah, I died because bad hero. Isn't it true that when you're flat cannoning under enemy tower, you can't retarget on your allied creeps in order to stop from getting hit because your attacks are splitting? Or does it not work when you're issuing an attack command on your own creep? You still can? Okay. It'd be funny if you're like trying to attack your own creep. Even though if it's full life, it works for AI, but it doesn't actually attack. But it still starts splitting off into enemy hero. And you're like, no, 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 stop shooting. Quit your mumbling. Let's guard, let, let's wear a fluffy hat. Middle tower is under attack. What's that? What's that? Oh, I tried to use see on creeps again maneuvering maneuvering Really? Yes, sir. Is that true? I'm not gonna do it. I have never tried to do that. You can use E to farm several camps at the same time. Yeah, that's nice. Man, when you're not dying all the time... You get so much gold. RIP. <laughs> Jinxed it! Bassif P? Yeah, I know. 
I accidentally did C instead. Or at least I clicked it. You use ulti is dead? Yeah, you're right. I use C and ulti is dead. But it's like snowboarding, you know? Do you guys know the snowboarding gaming analogy? Any snowboarders here? Okay. When you're on a very steep slope and you're snowboarding, when you get scared because the speed is too high, what would you instinctively do with your body? Lean back, which raises the tip of your snowboard, reducing friction and increasing speed. So when you're snowboarding, you need to override your instincts and lean forward when you're most scared. And that's what they call real courage. It's not the absence of fear. It's going forward when you are scared. And then things are gonna be all right. It's like snowboarding. Secured. Oops. I love his farming capabilities. Wait, who left? Sniper race quit. <laughs> Classic sniper. <laughs> You can use rocket on range creep to farm. Um, is it worth it? 381 damage. Wait, how do I have more damage? Oh yeah, nether shawl. Yo, it's so neat. Oh, he came back, guys. It's so neat that you can hold alt to see the benefits of nether shawl. Are there better neutrals yet? Cooldown reduction. Hey, I'll take that. That sounds yes, great. Sir. Even more. With shard using rocket on range, yes. Ah, yeah. They may have vision there. It seemed pretty obvious that they had vision there. I don't know, like, sometimes I just, I go somewhere and I just enjoy shooting the creeps. And I forget that there's five brains. Well, usually there's five brains. There's five brains on the other team that are judging me. I could have four staff, by the way. Do I TP back in? I have four TPs. I guess I'll just use it. going in you whippersnapper rocket fired 
Kill secured. Cloak of Flames. My jungle addiction continues. Armor and magic resistance. The enemy's bottom tower has fallen. Yeah, yeah. Regeneration. What's that? This will come in handy. Rotating. It's easy to understand why I have a jungle addiction, yeah? I play Warcraft 3. It's the game. Nice, level 18. That's like, oh, two sentries. I was like, that gives very little vision. I forgot that I bought two. It's okay. Ka-ching! So what do we have now? Cooldown reduction. Oh yeah, not spell power, but cooldown reduction. Is there a vision of me here? Don't know. me on the cart and then I force staffed him forward <laughs> did we want it was that our fight oh what what oh, I missed it we just killed two Void's chilling on the other lane yeah I think he just uh, was that Void that killed uh Actually, I, I didn't see who killed. You guys probably saw it. I don't know how to look at it yet. Check Void and Lancer item. Void has Wraithbound, ba Mask of Madness, Mjölnir, and uh, Ultimate Orb, and Yasha recipe. Hit to enter to see it. Oh. Uh, so Centaur killed a ward. Faceless took a bounty run. Centaur killed Lord of the Ping and Faces killed Kawaii. Ah. Same idea. Ah, now I know. That's the level up. What's that? Witchbane, purge. Your attacks deal bonus damage equal to your max mana. 4%. Cleanse. What does she currently have? I don't know. Is it, is it good? Your target's mana. Oh, that's kind of good against... It's a right click item, yeah. Uh, maybe I don't use it. I let someone else use it. 
It sounds pretty good against Oddworld Destroyer. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't right click a lot. I just went to fortify it. Okay, we finally have enough. You can force staff your missile, yeah. We practiced a bit with that in demo mode. We have so much vision, boys. decided this time to go in but he was wrong yes, sir. it was not time Got my bearings. what does lotus do oh spell spell reflect What's that? Speak up. We Roshan or? Run. Run. Run again. Illusion. We should just get rush. What? 
They're they're thinking about Roche for sure. We should not get Roche. Because they're thinking about it. Safe for buyback. I'm addicted to sentry wards. Why did he die? But yeah. Kill the rest. I got text. The enemy's top is gone. How long does this last? Six seconds. Are we still committed? My dire courier had been up there for ages. Yes, sir. The enemy's top barrels gone. Nice. Very nice. What if I told you there was an item that saw every sentry ward, every observer ward, and invisible units? How much would you pay? A thousand? For the low price of 600, you can see every ward. Right, but there's a catch, isn't there? If you die, it drops to the floor. Very nice. Nice game. I think this hero was uh, really comfy. Yeah, we got an honorable mention. 
this was fun. I had a lot of fun this game. I did a lot of uh, freedom of thought. Let's go around. What are we going to do? I mean, let, let's let's sum up and summarize. We stole some gold runes. We got caught with our pants down twice in the jungle by several members of the enemy team. We stole some gold runes. We harassed an outworld destroyer with level four when he was level eight. We did jungling, lots of jungling. Our first real game, we had a little mini uh, gyrocopter where we someone disconnected and we all left. And uh, we had lots of gold. Gold kept pouring in real nicely because of good farm. We had a nice build. And uh, we even remember to use many of these abilities because this base kit is kind of simple. Lots of warding and dewarding. Uh, I kept transferring Lotus Orb to people. Not during the right time, but I was just practicing, like, especially at the end, I was just practicing trying to, you know, trying to use it. Some force staffing. Uh, made pretty good use of Veil of Discord. Magic weakness. Mana regen, that never wrong. Yeah, it was really fun. I loved it. GG. For roaming, it's a good idea to time your gank movement. Getting level 357 for a new spell level is good. And having boots is nearly essential. Uh, or enemy will just see you coming and run away. Okay. Yeah. Makes sense. You can see how many wards you bought. Really how? <laughs> Nine observer wards. 14 sentry wards. But the enemy took 30 sentry wards between Witch Doctor and Elder Titan. And then my ally, 18th century ward, Centaur War Runner. Even though he was the core three carry, he still invested in sentry wards just cause only Sniper didn't get wards. And for us, only Faceless Void. Your Lotus was on N instead of X, where you had Tranquils. You will use items more if they're easier to reach. Yeah, it kind of worked out. I got used to it. <laughs> 